Steam Series, championed by your Southern California Toyota dealers. Well, he's working to restore a heartbeat using air hoses and magnets. It's time for this week's Steam Profile, and our focus today, technology, engineering, art, and math. Meet a Palos Verdes teen who's just been accepted to Stanford after creating a CPR machine. Whether he's on his back, looking up while fidgeting with connectors and wiring, or cutting through metal with a high-speed spinning blade, whenever Andreas Tempro has extra time on his hands, you can find him here in his Palos Verdes garage. I tinker around in my garage a lot. His goal? I want to solve problems in the world. I want to be someone that can look at a problem and be like, I can solve that. And Andreas is already well on his way. You're looking at his newest invention. I made an automatic non-electric CPR machine. It can essentially perform CPR automatically. Andreas got the idea during training to be a lifeguard. We are going through the CPR portion of the course and I looked around and I saw a lot of people couldn't perform CPR accurately. So it became apparent to me that I wanted to fix this issue. Andrea started writing computer code. He drafted prototypes using computer assisted drawing. Then he started to build the parts he needed using a 3D printer. Almost half the components I use are 3D printed. Of all the STEAM disciplines, Andreas relies most on technology, engineering, art and math, especially physics. The chest compressions are created by pressurized air. As you pressurize an air system, it's going to create a displacement. Which means the air has to go somewhere. Andreas's computer code and his design send that pressure to the chest. After it gives 30 compressions, it's going to prompt you to do your two breaths. Andreas's CPR machine took first place in the 2022 LA County Science Fair, then was awarded a finalist in the prestigious International Science and Engineering Fair earlier this month. Well, Andreas isn't quite done refining this invention. I'm constantly thinking of what I want to add onto my machine. He is also exploring what to create next. If I think of an idea, I'll just start building it. Andreas now has clarity on what he wants for a career, and it all started with pursuing a passion for the water and a fascination for first aid. I think biomedical engineering might be my route now, and I never would have thought of it if I didn't take a CPR class. Well, for more on STEAM careers, just go to our website, kcal9.com slash STEAM.